Hello everybody. Come to, my, to make a video. The first part of this is going to be about Donington Castle and the second part is about a video that Mickey found and we'll get to that later on because that's going to be the second part of this video but Mickey's here with me aren't you Mickey? Oh, okay. And tomorrow we're going to Donington Castle and all this time when I've said, well it's not a castle but it, it's now a fortified building but when I looked at it with Mickey I suddenly realised that I was now looking at this so like special. double wall and then we're going to put the video on because nobody knows that this is a star fort and I, I find that crazy yeah. how can that be why am I like the only one but the guy I told you was where you know if I saw the petals then his cinematography because he did the same thing like this but it was all yeah. computer and um, that's where I that I know it is now um, nobody else seems to notice I don't even think he noticed it was a star fort I mean we'll check me and Mickey are gonna go here tomorrow and I'm gonna check this bit mm. it's very interesting, to see how how deep that really is is that well I see look that's up the, that it must be quite a bit because you go up the hill to it but Mickey's also made me think that this is something else as well. We were looking at it. Oh, look, there's, there's, look, oh, sorry, Mickey, look, there's, look, that's like the star fort. Sorry, it's that way. It's facing, you know, we weren't sure what shape it was. That's because the star fort, did you see that? Let's go yeah. back. Sorry. Yeah. Than it looks. Did you see that? It's facing the star fort, which is here and here in the legs. It's facing that way. Because we can work out the shape, but it does have that star fort shape. Yeah. yeah. So I was thinking, well, I've never seen one like no, this before. No, nor me. Yeah. <coughs> Please have some more points. But you've also made me think about something that actually we're looking at a pyramid. Not thinking with the steps. Yeah, because what it is is when you get to the front of this here got this great big petal but it's going down the hill and so when you look at it maybe it's actually as you realize this is quite stepped and you can see it's it's beauty now yeah. that it's some whatever it is star fort um, <clears throat> not the biggest yeah that you can see that maybe I don't know because I don't know how deep it is here but this bit makes you feel like it's built on yeah, something yeah, yeah, else well. like is this and like when you get to here see this is the entrance or was an entrance mm. maybe that was an entrance into it you know we're thinking maybe it could be a pyramid so I mean it's got the shape of a pyramid now hasn't it here mm. but not here so much I don't know I've never Who's up? Hmm, maybe they went in there. Definitely. Originally, but here now you can see how stepped Too that is just... and how much of a star fort it really is. Yeah, that corner bit just sticks out of our... And nobody's... Like, this should be in our history. Don't you think? Mm-hmm. All they get is the castle, though. The castle of this story. Probably don't even know what they're walking on. I've obviously been here with, I'm going to go with you tomorrow, but I've been with a few other people because there's quite a lot of history. They say it's all to do with the Magna Carta. Um, yeah, and it's built in 13 something. So if the Star Fort is there, but not there now, the Star Fort's underneath whatever that is. See, so yeah. So here is this bit, I mean, is that an entrance? Mm. Was it an entrance? Well, but it's also like a leaf part of the mm. star fort, but it's going down the hill, which is a bit crazy. And I saw this bit here, I wonder what that was. Oh, just stop the video, hang on. But there it looks a bit more like a pyramid, doesn't it? And that could be the entrance in, but I don't know. Yeah, but this has got. Top, now we realise that gatehouses, because I was thinking, well, you know, it's just not. 
it's not really so important what's on the top there's rooms underneath and we've already learned that with if that guy's right about no Saxon invasions that they weren't it was to store things but they were so they could distribute it to the people which is you know like when I did the Brighton one and they were like they couldn't feed the people properly but they were building the pier and burrowing that pier it's gone now chain link pier they were burrowing it into the hill but they couldn't get milk and veg because there was no roads and it was all difficult feeding the people you can't be burrowing steel into a hill and not be able to feed the people so it's the same thing like they said these people that these were forts and fighting but they they had they had a mechanism set out to look after the people we've got storage we can then distribute it to the people that's totally different to the animals that they've told us we were But again, you know, I noticed this quite a while ago with the star fort. And there it is again, see, I don't know if everybody can see Going it, but... On the side, quite steep there, isn't it? Yeah, I never noticed that before, because when I've been, there's lots of stuff grown here. Is that weather? Yeah. So you can go round it, look. It is a hill, so it could be a pyramid. No, they won't do that. We'll have to buy one. Yeah, it's just, it's just too man-made. It is a bit, isn't it? But they're saying that castle was built in 1360 something, and that thing's underneath because we all want to know the ages of star forts, really. What, how old they are? And most of them. Excuse me. Oh, sneeze, sorry about that. Most of them have red brick in them as well, not, you know. So this one is mended with red brick. Mm. So that's that crazy, because we always thought that red brick was quite old, but it's mended with red brick. But look, see this, what is this? Is this... It's going up down again. I know it's got the star foot on it, but it could have been a pyramid. Oh, I don't know. I never thought of it like that. And something was here because there's a circle there. That looks really quite steep, doesn't it? Yeah, again. But I now see what I didn't see is the shape that it's from here to here, and this is the star fort. It's facing this way with this thing going down the hill. that let me show it under there and again it's built on top of a hill mm. I know not all of them are are they because some of them are in water but they did like to build on top of hills you can see it now do you see it it's like a butterfly laid out on the grass with that thing in the middle of it and like Mickey's quite sure that this kind of looked like a church, but it's straight here and it goes round there. So what is that? Oh, design. But even the turrets aren't the same. So the roof would have went up what higher. The heart would have been. So how come all this has been knocked down, but not that bit? So what is it? They knocked it. They've given us a false history. Knock this down and locked this up because this is where you go underground yeah, in there. Yeah, definitely. That's the main point. <clears throat> I mean, those stones are in the ground. You know, they're not sticking up like like this out of the ground. They're in the ground. Yeah, it's um. Oh look, you can see it there as well, around that tree. Mm. Myself, I find this quite fascinating. You know, for me, this is only a few miles away. Yeah. 
And when we go tomorrow, I'd like to see, you know, like when you said in London that the flint was flat. Yeah. And good. what did you say about flat flint? Well, that's like a crystal, isn't it? it turns into a crystal. It's atmospherical. So I'd like to see if they're flat yeah. or whether they're all sharp. I can't remember now. Mm. Got to be smooth. Yeah. I don't know how they could crack it to be that smooth, but they've done it somehow. You know, I crack a flint, I can't get it. And see here, this is where the beams went in for the whatever floor was there. That, that's for the floors. Yeah. And I think there's another one there. The entrance. Door, window, window, window. Two floors. Well, one floor, two floors. Which is amazing. Off the roof. Cut off there. But the one in France was very similar to this, except it had more of this and less turret. One of the turrets had been completely gone. I never noticed this bit over here. There it is. You can always see it in the ground, which you don't see when you're on the ground. And the other strange thing is, I mean, maybe that is flat. This, this one looks a bit different to this one, even though there's bits, I just don't know. Mm. So do you think sure. that they might have had pointed tops on, so these would look more fairy tale? When you take those pointed tops yeah, off, yeah. it's going to look like this. But if you, do you understand what I mean? The fairy tale ones, like the ones we're finding, you know, in the, the water pumps, they've got fairy tale tops on. Do you think they could have had wooden fairy tale tops on or something? <coughs> or whatever they did. Well, Isn't it strange that really. you can see here, here and here, that's obviously to put more roof on, right? So how come all that's missing? This is broken, but we've got the whole town. I just don't get that. Mm. And now this is all nice. neatly, sort of, it's all neat, isn't it? Okay. I mean, maybe that's as high as the wall was. Look, here's that bit again. God, I'd like to really know what it is. It's like a whole structure underneath this thing. Stepping again. What a shame you couldn't, what a shame they couldn't tell us the truth. And we could actually go into, I mean, maybe yeah. you'd have to have someone there, but we could go into the rooms, even though they did it a few times a year and see what's really underneath the ground. Yeah, we'd have to see. There it is again. There's the star fort. But you're you're saying that this is underground. But maybe I actually thought it was damaged, broken, and then that mm -hmm. grass has grown on the top. I know what you mean. So what it is is it, yeah. underneath here is a whole star fort. Okay, so when you got to dig it away. Can't be laid down. Well. We'll soon find out. Especially that corner bit. This has got a hill in it and we're on the hill, but it's flat. See, look at the shape of that. Yeah. Anyway, we just wondered now whether that was a pyramid after all. No. So, mm. It looks almost like it's breathed in or something then. Star fort. Mm. What a shame they could have just told us the truth. See, it's quite, when you think about it, it's actually quite round after all. So that could be a... Like you said, you noticed it could be... The river. Yeah, the river's there. This could have been a pyramid, then a star fort. See there, look. There's this big petal sticking out here. Which might be something else, or an entrance into it. Or... You can't see it. Yeah, those are the, those are the star fort leaves. Yeah. There's the sun going west. Going away. A bit dark this one. It's the last one now. No, you've almost got an arch like a semi circle there, isn't it? Yeah, it looks like this is on like a ship or something. Because there's the front of it there. We can see this, but you're walking uphill. This is until you get to here, you're walking uphill, so it's not as easy yeah. as just walking across that, you know, like this could be quite dented and 
We've got to get up, but we can have a look at it tomorrow because I never looked at it. Oh, what's that there? Look. Mm. See, that was something there. Square, isn't it? There, look. It's like another yeah. pet. Look, it's like we're looking at lots of petals. Did you see that? How weird's that? Should we play that again? To investigate that one. Just here, look. Do you see it? Or is it just me? Round no, I see it. Lots of petals. Almost like a bird of these. <gasps> bird, yeah. bird. I wonder if, like, if they are the stone stone, like, because you know, that like, engraved. We're we'll gonna have to check that stones, tomorrow. Yeah. See if they're really in it. It's a good thing we look at these videos and go, ah, oh, there it is. And just keep right to it. When you see it tomorrow, they see this bit. It's like someone's repointed all this. It's a bit mishmash. Yeah, I know what you mean. Yeah. This bit, like, like here, see, you can, you can see it. It's like that's what, really thick. Ah. They would not have that stick there. There'd be more flints. You know they would. And so that bit's kind of like, oh, they've, they've put cement all over it, but it still doesn't look new. The only way you find is like, when was it repaired by heritage in it? Because they're the only ones who do this sort of thing. Mishmash. Trying to make it look and old. I wonder what that's sticking out of it for. Mm. That's a what they call a lightning aerial, isn't it? Oh, right. Why would that be on there then? Wouldn't you not think that would go a little bit higher? Oh, what? Because the window's right to the top. Mm, yeah, it's it coming out here. Windows, can't it? Well, they had different tops on. It's like the, it's like now I mean, we realise about the, the Punzel towers. Yeah, there, it's like those or top bits Disney are missing. One. These could have had them all, and then it would have looked like fairy tale again. Yeah, exactly. It's so hard to know because uh, but with the flint, it's literally that's the t time of the church, isn't it? In Damara. Look at that. What's that there? Look, is it it's where people are walking? Well, this is this, this is what I spotted earlier. Yeah, that's what I spotted earlier. Because that pattern is like the uh, the star shape, the energy that it brings out, like it's waving, like it did across those black and white wall pictures. Oh yeah, look, do you see a different yeah. colour brick? Look, that's different to that. Yeah, I wonder if it's flint though. But you have to do a lot of digging for flint, but a flint's easy to carry, you know, hand by hand, keep them in a line. Oh look at that, there's like one of those gargoyles there, look. It's a German war, isn't it? Bucket by bucket. Goggles there, look. Right, we'll take that tomorrow. Anyway, see, it's not, it's square, it's flatter there, and it's sort of round. Oh, I don't get it, but anyway. Um, we yeah, I know. It's, 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 not, it's not quite well defined here to be round, really, is it? It's a bit off. Like, right. Anyway, weird, Mickey and I are going to go tomorrow and make another video. Yeah, it'll be out on the channel, but I don't know what that is now. It could be a pyramid. Anyway, thanks for helping me make that part of the video, Mickey. Thank you. So, we're at Donington Castle. There it is up the hill. There's Mickey! It's cold. It's not that cold. It's actually quite steep, but I don't know. There's something just here and there it is actually looks like it's in my camera it looks like it's it's not leaning back but it looks well i don't know anyway mended with brick do you see the brick i find that really weird nobody else notices it's mended in brick Yeah, we keep trying to finish this video, and um, <laughs> and basically at the very beginning of the video, I said I noticed that it looked, and then I thought, oh no, no, it's just me. But when I stopped this to make the video, well, can anybody see it yet? I don't know. This turret is not straight. I just noticed that. <coughs> this is a little bit weird, isn't it? Yeah, like a tower pizza. A little bit. Anyway, 
It might mean nothing, but it's just a little bit of an observation that that turret isn't quite standing straight. Hmm. Yeah, so suddenly, when I hadn't seen it before, saw that when you look at this building, it's straight there, but it isn't there. It's a different shape. And that might be why this turret looks off, slightly off, because the building's a little bit different. It is weird, that, isn't it, though, that yeah. that is shaped like that. What does that mean? What does that mean? What does it mean? I think that's another room. What do you mean? As in, like, it's not, uh, there's another part of that wall's off. Like, this is, like, uh, just a cover. But there would have been another floor here. Because there's two doors here on these sides. I know, but why would they not make the castle go... I mean, if you look, right, do you see what I mean? Like, my bit, it's thicker mm. here. Than it is there. Certainly. Yeah. I don't understand that either. And then it's got these three things here, which it doesn't yeah. have any here. Oh, look, it's got writing on there. Do you see that? Yeah. Two. Do you see that? Yeah. Do you see it's like Quite writing? Yeah. Well, we, we always find writing on things. I hope everybody can kind of see that. It looks like two. Uh, it's just, it's crazy that these things turn up. I mean, what is that doing there? On top of a castle thing, fortified building mm. that could be on a pyramid and on a star fort. But anyway, that's just something else I noticed. So, it's being told to us that it was a castle and it's sort of been downgraded a little bit to a fortified building. We now know that fortified buildings that it's not that this is the most important thing, it's it's what's underground, yeah. you know, the, the rooms. Yeah. Now we know they could be for helping the people, not some war thing. Uh, the lady today said that there was a big war here and they surrendered and rah, rah, rah. But, you know, this bit when we said it could be a pyramid, sort of, do you see? I don't know. But it's definitely a star fort. And I was saying to Mickey, like, as this is a star fort, this is not right then, is it? Do, do you understand what? Because this is obviously here first. <coughs> when we see star forts, they don't really have these kind of buildings no, on them. It's a little bit hard to, because they've told us this was built in 1360 something. Maybe that's why they've rendered it. Because it's really another building. I've told you, it's weird, isn't it? How they've, it's got this weird rendering on it. Yeah. I don't know, but anyway, we keep looking at this stuff. When you, one second. And not only did Mickey bring my attention to this video, um, Donington Castle kind of now links with this because that's the kind of shape it is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I really didn't think it was. You know, like I, I just couldn't quite work out what it was. It may not be quite that shape, but it's something like that. Except, obviously, this one goes down the hill and looks like it's been sucked in. Like, these almost look like they've been sucked in a bit. But there are obviously the walls like this and grass has grown over it. But it doesn't kind of look like that either does it and you only see it not when you're on the ground no, on above you wouldn't say hey we're walking on a brick wall <laughs> you just wouldn't know but now you know you can see there's something here yeah. mm. anyway yeah we keep finding little bits to add in and mickey's noticed these it goes round here what he's reckoning is that that do you think that was floorboards then because it's it's there but it's not got them it hasn't got them there but it's got these things do you see these things here so they're for floorboards he reckons don't you mickey don't you that looks like wood doesn't it 
Is it wood or stone? It looks it's stone, isn't it? Yeah, it's wood. But it looked like wood. Yeah. But you see, it's been mended with this. It's been mended loads of times. It's got different. So it's got different bricks there, and then it's got like someone's mended it there. Floss is now exploring. She says, "Look, there's that dog I want." See, there's one of the leaves over there. That's one of the leaves. And this is another leaf here, we saw on the thing. But well, we're going to have to walk round the outside, Mickey. Because I've only ever walked round in here. There's the sun. And then, yeah, we're going to look at the leaves in a minute. I wanted to show you this bit. It's quite weird up here. So it's like a tunnel, but it doesn't go, it goes, it would go in there, but it's not very deep. But the other side is a fireplace. So maybe that was a cooking oven or something. Look at that beautiful view of Berkshire. And there's that building. I do like it coming here. But it's amazing. Where's the rest of it? Where's the rest of the building? Should I tell them? Should I tell them? Yeah. We did tell them, didn't we? Yeah. And actually, they were really pleased about what we said, and that because I told them it was a star fort, I told them to go and look at drone footage of Donington Castle, and you can see the leaves on the ground, and they were really happy, weren't yeah. they? They didn't say, "Oh, how preposterous! Go away." Yeah, I was expecting they could have been rude. And you sit there going, do, do I, do I, don't I? But I did tell these people. They seem very interesting. Yeah, we didn't tell them the rest of the truth, but <laughs> we told them that bit and they they liked it. So that was good, wasn't it, Mickey? Yeah. yeah. It's here it's one of the leaves we can see it really clearly but it's actually quite difficult to this is one of the leaves here and then this is the wall like we're on the wall I'm going to show you I'm going to go down I don't want to kill myself I'm good at falling over remember I told you right and then that's the wall of the Star Wars fort. And then we notice that there's another one over there. Oh, whoops. That one's not very... Uh, there's another one just there. And this is the wall of the Star Fort as it goes round. The castle. And this bit here is the wall. With the star fort bit on it. This bit here. I couldn't show it any better than this. Is what I said that when you get here, you can't see what you see on the aerial footage. It's different with the drone stuff or cine photography, but that's the wall. And there's the castle. And there's the dog. There's Mickey. Anyway, we're going to finish our walk now because it's freezing up here, isn't it? It is pretty cold today. Yeah, it's got a coldness in the air. But anyway, that's Donington Castle again. Or 45 building with rooms underneath. Yeah, that um, video is just a few minutes of our walk today up to see Donington Castle. Um, I knew we wouldn't see it properly on the ground. I told you this because it's just amazing that the aerial ones show it, but don't quite see it so except do you still because yesterday we thought well it, we do see now the star fault in it and it's facing this way yeah. um yeah. in the ground that's what we see from the from the footage before this with the 
drone stuff. And then, I don't know, do you think it's some kind of pyramid? No, it's just, it's a, it's like a starport, isn't it? Yeah. It's a real yeah. shame they tried to sort of cover up the walls and yeah, everything. Basically Why wouldn't they want to uncover that? That's a question, isn't it? And it's got the rooms underneath, pretty sure about that, and you yeah. felt that there was like, when it goes down in that bit, it could have been a staircase. Yeah, the spiral, yeah. <clears throat> it's, it's definitely fun. one in the tower, had staircase down. Oh, God, yeah. I'd say both towers. But we did see a bit of the wall, but it's so hard because I'm trying to explain it to you, mm. but it's not so easy, just that little camera light. I could see that yeah. petal really clearly, but yeah. it didn't come out on the camera like that. And it was sunken, which is a bit weird, isn't it? Well, that maybe is because that, that means the walls sure, can't sure. be that high. And then why is that bit, you know, I, I can't um, just grab a picture up, but we showed at the front, like, um, you know, down this part here, that there's a big leaf, but it's coming down the hill. It's not flat. Yeah, so it was, that was a bit weird, but you can't really tell, can you? And it's so cold up there, you can't even stand around that long to look for things. <laughs> Is that we could see no, that they it was leaf and wool, yeah. but it was covered in grass. Yeah. But it didn't feel like you were walking on brick or stone or anything, did it? No, no. Did you like it? Did you get I a good? It. Did you get a good feeling there? Yeah, it was a positive feeling there. Yeah, we walked around it. Yeah. Did you think anything yeah, else? Because obviously I've been up there loads of times, and mm. don't forget, first of all, you have to get past what they've told you is the history because yeah. it's not. So yeah. for years I'd have said, "Oh look, there's this," and all this yeah. is. They say it's to do with the Magna Carta, which is still quite important. Yeah. And then the lady today, when we went, what did she say? She said, in this castle, when they surrendered, they came out with their hands up, but they were allowed to leave. No, they came out leaving it. They could just leave it as long as they left it. So that, that means they gave up the power of this place. But, you know, it seems that they were still distributing goods to the people rather than fighting. So we were at mm. peace. This time when we said time. that we were at peace. Mm, we still don't quite know when that is. And this was supposedly built in 13 something. And what that means is the star fort must have already been there. So it's got to be before that. And there's just no way people in the 10th and 12th century would be, with what they've taught us, would be able to build all these star forts. And then later on you got... So, yeah, what we're going to do is we're just going to show again the star fort that this is, or what's under, what's there. Hang on a second. So obviously this video must have been made a little while ago because it wasn't that easy to see all this. Was it? It was a bit hard to show you what we were looking at here. So obviously we walk up this path, we go round here, we go into it. Then we come round. Let's go over here. Yeah. I'm standing here trying to show you this leaf because it's indented in, but it didn't happen. And then me and Mickey walk down here. Let's get across here. We walked round it this way, and then we walk down here. But it's just quite it's high, high and yeah. they've let all this overgrow, haven't they? So it's a bit hard, but you can see. So there's one here. And one here. Oh, let's go back. I forgot to move the camera across. So, one here and one here. One here and one here. There is one there. So that's an extra one. And there's this big one down here. Yeah, you can definitely see the wall. What a shame they've not excavated this and shown us properly what it is. Thanks, thanks for okay, helping me Lovely do the video. Mm -hmm. You enjoyed that? Yeah, day out there. I probably would have liked to, if it would be really nice weather, I'd like to have stayed a bit longer, yeah, but definitely. it was actually quite cold. <coughs> so, you know, you feel, right, seen it now, let's go. <laughs> yeah. And I hope that everybody else can see another star fort that's not talked about. Here it is. And if this was built in 13 something, when was this built? Because this is on top of that. Thank you, Mickey. No, thank you, chat room. Thank you, everybody. Thank you. 
So, the um, Donington Star Fort is about that kind of size. Mm. It's mm. a bit actually it's hard easy. because you've seen that shape before, but trying to explain it to you because it does have this big long petal out the front, you know, mm. like this one, but bigger out the front, which is going down the hill, which the smaller ones don't, and it does have quite, you know, it has, it doesn't have one, two, three, and it has more petals. Mm. Mm. I'm not sure if it's kind of means it's older or anything, but it's more, I suppose, well, it's a bit more like that, but there's more petals in it. But anyway, we just wanted to show you, and um, that was our trip to Donington. Um, it's obviously got a lot of hidden history, hasn't it? Yeah. Well, anyway, it's a bit more like that. There's the like the, the the one that hangs out the bottom, going down the hill. It's bigger. It's bigger than the other ones. Yeah. Anyway, we're finishing now. I think we've been trying to finish for ages, but we've stuck another bit in. Anyway. Bit. <laughs> Thank you, Mickey. Oh, no, there's a bit like over here, like this one up here. Like this. It's sort of like this, isn't mm, it? Mm, mm. It's just, it's, gotcha. it's a bit weird, the shape of it. So it's not quite like one of these. It's, it's, yeah, it's like it's got these bits and all, it's just, yeah. It's hard to explain, but it is a star fort. So Gary, you and James now know it's a star fort. Mm, mm. But nobody around here does. But at least those people today know it's a star fort now. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe we spread the them. word. Yeah. <laughs> the real word. Yeah. The truth. But again, nobody around here knows that no, Silver Hill is no. a pyramid. They'll just think it's a mound and part of. Yeah. You know, yeah. They know it's old and everything, yeah, but they don't know it's a pyramid. Hmm. Mm. Sad state it's of play, history. isn't it? Yeah. Just living in this fake world. It's his story. Okay. Yeah. Poor people now know. But know where's the link? Because there's got to be more star forts around it. Yeah, that's the thing, isn't it? These are coming freezing too. But, uh, yeah. And that golf course, there is one there. That probably they've destroyed something by yeah. doing that. Yeah. Well, golf course is the classic, isn't it? Well, so yeah, uh, and military, right. military's the same. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah. To stop you seeing what's really the there. Yeah. Anyway, oh, no. thanks a lot. Oh look, there's another one there, so I just want to go and I see another one. Mm. This one's quite small. This one here, but this one, look. It's more like that, isn't it? See, it's got one there, those there. It's more like that, isn't it? Yeah, let's have a quick look at this one. Yeah, I think... It has this big one that comes <coughs> down the front. Then you can see, maybe they're not even quite like this. They're a bit more over here, but it's that kind of shape, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. Well, especially, where you come from. especially with this big one at the front yeah. going down. I suppose you can't ever tell. Anyway, we've, we've, we've said enough now. Hopefully everybody can see what we're saying. Anyway, thanks everybody. Yeah, um, this bit here amazes me because if you take this as my house here and it's facing east, I've always said that if you put a semicircle out of the front of my house, the sun comes up in the winter here and in the summer it comes up here. And then I was just looking at this because this is masonry symbols and masonry stuff and you know, when you look at that, that's squaring the circle, isn't it? There's the circle, and there's the square. Squaring the circle. I thought that's quite interesting. But anyway, you can even use this thing if you like. It's the same thing because they always come, they, as there's no circling with the sun and the moon. I've never seen it doing any circling. All I see it is doing like triangles. But, um,. I thought that was very interesting, this bit here with the semicircle. Because if you put a semicircle outside my window, 
comes up on that semicircle during the seasons season of you know it changes season but I just wanted to add that bit to the video anyway now we continue hi everybody this is a continuation as said this is part two of the video Mickey found this lady um, I'll show you her name in a minute what's her name Mickey Michelle Gibson there you go Michelle Gibson he kind of liked watching this because well you saw bricks didn't you and also the star forts she talks about star forts um, she said something very interesting about those pillars um, what she basically said was that the pillars mean that things are underground. When it's got pillars on it, it means there's something under the ground as well, from the top to the bottom. But you see this? And if I had to explain, like, how I see the sun, this is how I see it. And then later on, there's pictures of the sun. I thought that was quite interesting. And then she's bringing this up. This is about in Copenhagen. It's got roses in it. And I did wonder about the war of the roses. Yeah, anyway, with the Freemasonry stuff, it's all about triangles. So obviously she's got triangle there, triangle there, and there's another one. Oh, I thought there was another one as well. But anyway, it's all to do with triangling. Yeah. So that was quite interesting, wasn't it? Mm -hmm. So basically, she's finding the degrees, triangles, and there's three star forts in this one place connected. And, um, you know, it just sort of runs on from Donington Castle, really, because that's a star fort, a bit like the one that's on the screen now, I suppose. Yeah. Huh. Actually, yeah, sure. I didn't think it was really a shape, because I couldn't really work it out, but it's something like that. Anyway, so this is... Oh, yeah, and that building there you're pointing to, even though it's in that star fort, was a hospital. There it is. Pictures of it as the hospital. with spirals and things and then she's talking about these three places they're all different places and they've always got that wall going as well so there's that there as well but this is in Copenhagen but anyway I just found that very interesting and then of course Donington Castle has a star fort in it and everything seems to be related to star forts lately not pyramids it's, all, it's more star forts than anything else Mickey likes star forts, don't he? Yeah, I dig them. He dig them. He digs them. Anyway, there you go. Then she was noticing the different, different angles on the triangles. I oh, know it's a bit, a bit complicated, really. But very interesting. There you go. There's a bit more as part of her video. But we're finishing now, Mickey. So thanks for bringing this video to my attention. That's fine, Kat. No problem. Ah. And thank obviously, you. yeah. Thank you, Mickey. Thank you, everybody, for watching. Got What's that. everybody else's thoughts? Because obviously, you know, it's such a strange thing, these star forts. And, you know, it's that, I don't know, Donington and here. Yeah. Amazing, yeah. aren't they? They're just amazing things. <clears throat> Do we really understand what they're for? Lots of canals it's link up with these things. It's Water. I'm trying to find out, isn't it? Mm. Yeah, pretend like they don't exist. There's thousands of them. It was built as a summer home in 1606 for King Christian IV, who we're told was responsible for many of these star fortifications in Copenhagen. Anyway, um, you know, I was looking at it, and it quite these things quite related to the sun. It's how it comes up, like that semicircle at the beginning of the video. The sun can come up in the winter on the south and, the, and, the, and on the north in the winter. So that's all interesting. And then this is the royal family in Copenhagen at the time all this stuff's happening. And there's double eagles or double griffins. And get again, the rose. Yeah. I don't know. It's a bit strange, that rose and the war of the roses and all that stuff. We'll never know the truth of it, or will we? Whoever let us know the truth. And then that bit... She put in New Atlantis. Hmm. Ah, you can obviously stop and read that if you want to. Oh yeah, this is the other bit. See those mounds? In America, houses have been built on top of these mounds. The mounds were already there. They're part of star forts, and people might not realise the houses have been built on top, like this one. They're on top of mounds, and the mounds are star forts. Yeah. Ah. 
amazing. I might even find a picture to show that, um, Mickey. Yeah. Mickey reckons that this, oh, I might not show. This is a river. It's all connected with this. It looks like it, doesn't it? So here, I thought I'd quickly show you this picture here. This is of a house. It's from that video there. It's been on Sun and Moon. It went out in January. And as you can see, it's built on a mound. So what that probably means is that that house is also built on a star fort. And that's not the only picture. There's a few more of houses being built on the mounds. And these mounds must be star forts. But they're not showing you or saying that, are they? Because they wouldn't do that. On the Castellet started in 1626, well after the Danish king's trip to England in 1606, as well as a later trip he made there in 1614. Though this fortress is monstrous, on the king's bastion today only a few small cannons are on display, near a windmill on an octagonal base. The buildings on Castellet are military barracks and storage, but there was at one time a granary on site to feed the soldiers living there. Two moats encircle the star fort. The thin angled line of earthworks between them originally contained four ravelins, these smaller detached triangles. Each ravelin housed a smithy forge, one of them is still in operation today. Measuring the angles of each bastion, we do find a slight pattern. Both pink angles at the bottom measure 71 degrees. The two green angles in the middle measure 62 degrees. And at the top, the king's bastion measures 80 degrees. The angles were clearly deliberate and each value reduces to the number eight. Right, this is um, the last part of the video, so thanks very much, Mickey. Yeah, Mickey's quite enjoyed this, probably going to look at it again. Oh look, look at all those uh, windmills. And we now know windmills take water out and then she's circled well, like with the yellow as part of this star fort. But yeah, it's her explanation isn't it? So she was drawing her, so, oh, another windmill down there by the yellow thing. But then when they uncover buildings, you know, in towns, they're showing you those kind of levels, aren't they, where it all goes down like that and then they put pavements halfway up there you know further up they found that very interesting especially with all those whoops with all those windmills and then there see is built up star foundation so that's that house was built on top of one of those I just showed that amazing how they're hiding it obviously at ground level we just <coughs> don't see it you need a drone for everything yeah everybody put your drones up see mm -hmm. if you can see a star fort in your back garden. Uh, it's all interesting. I don't know if these pictures are moving very fast, but this is the last part of the video. There you go. It's back to her triangles and these star forts, and it's part of something else. Is that that bit there? Is that where the, the trees were? And you said it looked like the river. That's that's that bit there, and then they've yeah, cut that bit there. off, haven't yeah. they? Yeah. Mm. And there it is again, and of course that building there, which has got circle around it, was a hospital. So she's saying. Um, and all to do with these triangles and they're not all the same size and obviously her no, videos to do with Freemasons and yeah. everything like that even though they have devoted to the square isn't it? yeah they, they can't see that but there's a bit I'm hoping they can see this and there's a bit like there and, and just designed. and then she was saying when it's got pillars on it it's what's on, it's, it goes down I thought that was quite interesting. Anything with pillars on is a building that's got a basement or something. Anyway, really enjoyed making that video. Thanks very much. Thank you, Karen. Thank you, chat room.